A superstar gets a certain feeling when he knows there's a strong possibility he may exit the match in a completely different condition than he entered. That's not exactly a comforting thought when it's your career. And just like that, we're off and running. Both men know how big this championship Two. match is. Even in these early moments, you can feel the excitement. This is gonna be great. That's what happens when you're in a powerful grasp. You go down. Oh, that slam was vicious. I'm not sure I can watch this. Well, obviously, some superstars are better than others on the run. And if we were gonna make a list of the best running moves out there, I'd put John Cena's shoulder block right at the top. Oh, yeah. I mean, if he catches an opponent flush coming off the ropes at full speed, Cena's liable to knock him into next week. Seven. Now back to the ring. Man, talk about putting a target on someone's back. Quick thinking to avoid that. Not today, too fast. Now with complete control. Folks, it was in this city of Houston, Texas that Stone Cold Steve Austin did the unthinkable when he aligned himself with Mr. McMahon at WrestleMania 17. We touched on the running shoulder block that John Cena uses to such damaging effect, and it's a move he actually perfected well before his time in WWE when he was a college football All-American. You know, King, I don't think Cena thought when he was dropping opponents on the gridiron that he would one day be the franchise of WWE right. on the field or in the ring. Cena's shoulder block is awesome. Oh, you're right about that. I think Cena knew right away that his powerful shoulder block was a major Six. weapon for him. Cena discovered it on the football field, as you said, and brought it with him to the WWE. There's quite a long list of superstars that Cena has rocked to the mat with that move. This is what makes him so dangerous. Well, when you look at the illustrious career of John Cena starting way back in 2002, and since then, 21 championships, an astounding accomplishment, and never a dull moment. Oh, you're right about that. And don't forget the 15 world championships. 11 reigns, of course, as the WWE champion. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Makes the cover. How you make an impact. And the thing about John Cena that stands out, only Bob Backlund and Bruno San Martino have more days combined as WWE Champion. In the 11 reigns as WWE Champion, we were just talking about, that, folks, is a WWE record. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. Cena with a textbook counter. Yeah, you know, I know some people don't want to hear it, but the truth is, John Cena is so technically sound. We've seen this before. You know, Cole, more recently, incredible move by John Cena. And into the cover. One. Now, who does a methodical pace benefit, King? Well, I'll tell you, whenever the dominating competitor takes his time, it gives everybody a chance to catch their breath. He's really going out to the neck tonight. Yeah, that neck is going to be sore tomorrow. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. John Cena with a nice reversal. Going for broke. Oh, my. John Cena. to a 
avoid that. And there's a kick to the face doing significant harm. You're right about that. Their nose will never be the same. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. We're looking at complete domination here. We're so excited you chose to spend your Sunday with us. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. What happened to you? You used to love being outside the ring. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. One move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. Huge power move. I have a feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over. Going toe-to-toe -to -toe here. And will this be it? It may be. Anytime we have John Cena in the ring, Michael, I can't help but think of the most memorable matches he's given us over the years and what were some of the biggest events WWE has ever staged. I mean, maybe none bigger than his win over Edge at Unforgiven in 2006. He turned the wrestling world on its ear that night. We have plenty of action scheduled for you on this Sunday night. Nicely done there. That was a thing of beauty. Just amazing. It's safe to say he underwent special training to put on this kind of aerial display. Right. Yeah, or maybe it's the winner and new champion. Spectacular match. You want to talk about incredible high impact sports entertainment? Check out what happened during this match. This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. You want to talk about incredible high impact sports entertainment? Check out what happened during this match.
Here's your winner and the new Intercontinental Champion, Soul Man. Oh my gosh, new champion. And will things in the WWE ever be the same again? You're right, I think the entire landscape of the WWE just changed. But let's not forget.